There's over 30,000 people that go hungry every day in our community. I'm working and I have uh, including myself four people in my household and I'm a single parent. You know, the money doesn't go long enough for the whole entire month and this, this actually helps out. And some things that, you know, I can't afford to buy some of the things they, you know, offer here. And so every day we need to find a way to get food into the food bank so that our 73 partner agencies have the food that they need to replenish their shelves so that when somebody is hungry in Stafford, Spotsylvania, or Caroline, King George, City of Fredericksburg, or even Locust Grove, that way we can get that food out in a timely manner to these folks. We also have a mobile pantry and that truck goes out to 10 sites throughout the month to provide food to those living in remote areas of the planning district. I've been a house painter for 42 years, and right now my work is very slow. I get on my Social Security every month, and we pay our regular bills, our house payment, and our, our utilities. And after that, it's very little left. And we have to depend on this food program. The food bank would not work without public support. We need to have donations sent to us, uh, online donations or through mail-in donations, or we have to have people donate time here at the food bank to assist with that as well. Working for the government, I basically got laid off. We found ourselves learning about food pantries, the food bank, and that was a big help in us being able to survive and put food on the table. Now that we get to give back to the people that we know from food pantries, that we were in line with them, we can now give them hope that they can make it out and they can they will survive